Today I'm going for my trademark edits in Snapseed and some vibrant color tuning in the free Lightroom app. Starting in Snapseed, adding couple of selective filters to add saturation to the blues and the greens. You can now notice some purplish color in the sky on the top right corner which I will deal later. Next applying some contrast with the soft contrast preset in the curves tool. Now for some dodge and burn effect I'm gonna use the vintage filter. Applying it with the preset 12 which adds a soft black vignette, we we'll leave it at default values. Then with masking, tapping the stacks icon here on the top right corner, view edits, vintage filter and brush. Here with the filter enabled and brush value at 0, erasing the effect in certain parts to give the overall image a dodge and burn effect. Next we'll try adding some morning fog effect. In the curves I'm gonna lift the blacks by dragging the low point up. And with masking applying it around here to give it a fog effect. By toggling the eye icon you can see where the effect is applied. The subtle difference here. One more curves edit, this time to give this person riding a little pop. So selecting the hot contrast preset and with masking applying it here, you can see the difference. Next for some vibrant color tuning exporting the image to the free Lightroom app. In Lightroom here tuning the whites and the blacks to brighten the brightest parts and darken the darkest. Using the two finger swipe to know where the whites and blacks are getting clipped. Next to the HSL sliders in the color menu mix. Now I'm gonna deal with the purplish color in the sky by moving the purple hue slider towards blue which turns the purple color to blue. Adding some saturation to it. Now moving the blues a little towards aqua for some cyan look. Reducing the saturation a little. Also the brightness. As I'm going for a vibrant look moving the greens towards aqua a bit. 
little brightness. There is always some yellows in the leaves, moving it more towards green. Moving the orange hues towards red. Adding overall vibrance. Reducing the saturation of the oranges turned red a bit. So here's the final look. Thanks for watching.